question 20 structural isomerism and stereo isomerism uh, should be considered okay so the first uh, reaction is the reduction because the compounds reacts with the sodium borohydride after that the product is heated with alumina at 600 degrees C so from here we know that the product undergo dehydration so two process involved first is reduction followed by dehydration and it will pro produce one or more isomers so from these uh, compounds which one will produce most isomers after the two reactions okay let's start with butana butana okay the formula is this after it's undergo reduction okay here add one hydrogen here add another hydrogen it will form this butane one o and this butane one o after it's dehydrate so this oh will remove with this h to form this Built one in. So this one, it cannot form cis trans. That's why it's only one isomer. Okay, after that, B, butanone. Butanone, <clears throat> the formula is this. First reaction again, reduction. Here add one hydrogen, here add another hydrogen, form butane 2 O. Butane 2 O the OH will remove with this H to form the first isomer, this one. And this OH also can remove with this H, then it will form this isomer. Okay, so please remember, this isomer can form cis trans because the CC double bond, this these uh, two carbon it has two different groups 1H and methyl 1H and methyl that's why it can form cis trans so it means total two isomers form so 1 plus 2 total is 3 okay so for pentane 3 okay uh, 1 so this one is uh, after reduction, then it will form this alcohol. After that, this OH will remove with this or this H same because they are equivalents. So eventually it will form this product. And this one can form cis trans as well, means total it can form two. Okay, so means B is still the most isomer so far. Okay, D, if you understand how the thing works, so you should know it will not really form a lot of isomers. Okay, so the uh, propanone, after reduce, will form this alcohol. And this OH will remove with this H or this H, same, to form this propene. So it just can form one isomer, no cis trans. Okay, therefore, answer is B because it can form three isomers. That's all for this question. Thank you.